So hi everyone. A big news is coming from Google that they have released Gemini Code Assist, AI coding assistant for any language. This is very much similar to GitHub Copilot, and the best part being this is free for everyone. And I was just trying to use it, and it was amazing as well. There are multiple features that the team has given, and it is released as an extension for Visual Studio Code and JetBrains, that is PyCharm basically. So experience coding with fewer limits as you can see brings the power of gemini 2.0 to your id at no cost as you can see the limit is quite generous a limit of 6000 code related requests and 240 chat requests daily i think this is more than enough for a regular developer reduce your code review time and help improve quality it can automatically review a pull request as well such as code changes and fixes this is some crazy stuff that google has released quite silently Get relevant code and chat with a large context window. Build a better app with AI assistance in Firebase, etc. So I will just show you how you can use the, the Gemini code assist for free. So for that, you need to have Visual Studio code or you need to have either PyCharm in your system. As you can see now, I have opened my Visual Studio code window. So I will be telling you how you can use Gemini code assistant for free. So first of all, you need to go to extensions as you can see here just click here and just search for gemini so you should be able to see this particular extension gemini code assist and here you need to install this one so once you do it then go to your notebook whatever you wish to edit and at the bottom as you can see my just follow my cursor there would be a star sign that represents gemini just click on that and you would be you need you would need to uh, log in into your google account and then gemini would be visible to you so let's get started let me try out i have a basic code present with me so i'll try to clean this up or like i will try to update it using the gemini code assist now so let's get started uh this is the gemini sign as you can see here gemini generate code gemini explain this gemini generate unit test cases as you can see the bulb sign let me ask gemini explain this the gemini code assist is working as on you can see on the left pane we will be trying out all the different features and let's see how it performs as you can see now it is giving you an explanation here you can read it quite in detail the code snippet is responsible for printing evaluation matrix preparing data for plotting etc etc so let's now you just need to mention what you want to do and it will edit as well. Just select this particular code snippet and then add to chat. Create code to generate matplotlib plots for the particular metrics mentioned. So now it will be helping you to generate codes as well. You can then try running the code. It may If it throws some error, you can again reselect and mention your issues and you should be able to get the solution for that instantly. Here you can see that now we have got the codes also. Just place your cursor and go to this particular plus sign and eventually the code would be coming into your notebook as well. Copy, you can diff with open file, open a new file, multiple things are there. It has also given an explanation also, updating plotted, plotting code, how to run the code, etc. Now let me try out something else as well. Okay update the code to introduce hyperparameter tuning so this code is basically a machine learning pipeline that i have used i'm not deep diving into its what its capabilities are but just trying to show you how easy it is to use google code gemini assist and eventually it's free to use i think that's the biggest uh, plus point that the team has given and you can use it for free using gemini 2 so gemini 2 is a great model that the team has recently added now we have added the new code and this looks to be more interesting we can ask it questions around please explain this to me click on the plus sign explain this generate code generate unit test case so let me click on generate unit test case this time let's see what it generates so this is what is meant by vibe coding what Andrej Karpati already mentioned you're not touching your keyboard and everything is getting coded for you I think the time for coding is limited now as I can see this is really really tough as you can see now it, some codes has been generated you can now click 
you can create a new file you can copy paste the test cases there you can do many things now you can also click on this select this code and ask it to explain what it is doing and multiple features so i think this is how you can use gemini code assist smart actions the multiple things forward slash fix forward slash generate explain this generate unit test cases so multiple features are there just mention fix data leakage let me try what it does data leakage issue whether it is able to take this or not gemini is thinking as you can see so i know the battle between for generative ai between the big tech is getting real you now have github copilot coming in cursor is there gemini code assist is free using gemini too so i think the time is coming out straight and it's high time so now you can see that it has highlighted certain codes for us plus minus copy deleted lines copy deleted line 4 reward this changes you can play around with the tool multiple things are there except decline options are there you are accepting all the changes you're declining whatever it works for you so this is how you can use google gemini code assist for free this uses gemini 2.0 the best model so i think any day the best choice for coding ai assist thank you so much